Hey guys, it's Maven, and welcome to another game. And today, we're back with episode 2 of Sims 4 Murder Mystery. And... We just found out that Pearl was sadly, um... Well, is sadly dead now. And... Now, here becomes the beginning. So basically, we have Ashley over here. And now, what she's gonna do is that she's just gonna talk to the remaining, um... People that are alive, saying what they need to do. Ashley says that there's three places you can go to. One place is called the morgue, where the body will be. And the other place is called the last known whereabouts, which was where the location... Um, the location of the person that was killed before the crime scene. And then we have the crime scene. And also, just to let y'all know, um, if you, any of y'all have seen the show Who Done It, this game is largely based on this. So I give them credit to creating 70s. Okay, now we have... Now, each person must decide where they want to go. Out of the three places, they can choose one. And in each place, they will find their own clues. So now, it is time to decide which place they will go to. Okay, so everybody has made their choices. Kara, who is by herself in this one, she has decided that she will go to the morgue. Um, Annika and Becca have decided to go to the crime scene, while everyone else has decided to go to the last known whereabouts. So yeah, let's get them to look for their clues. Okay guys, we are back and everyone has looked in the room and collected some of their own clues. So yeah, now it is time for a competition to decide which person here gets the most powerful clue in determining the puzzle of, well, of the crime. So yeah, let's get to it. 